Hey y'all, welcome back to Brandy's Decor and More. If you're visiting for the first time, welcome. And I am going to show a DIY, and I haven't had a DIY on my channel in some time now, but um, I'm trying to squeeze in a few last minute fall crafts before I start on my DIYs for Christmas. So I wanted to share with y'all this candle uh, that I made and it is only using two Dollar Tree products. So I'm gonna go ahead and get into uh, the portion where I uh, actually show the footage of how I uh, put this together. And uh, more than likely, I will be doing a voiceover on that. So uh, that way you'll, you can hear step-by-step step of uh, how that was done. Uh, I will admit that it is uh, a little bit shaky at times just because the fact that I had to hold my phone with one hand and try to film and then uh, do the DIY with my other hand. So uh, it was a little bit challenging. And uh, so uh, let's go ahead and get on into uh, the footage and um, I hope that you enjoy this video, and uh, let's go ahead and get started. You'll notice here that I set the eye of the stove to low, but I did go back and I did change the setting to a medium high uh, instead because I noticed that on low it was not really doing anything. Uh, I did have to fill up the pot more, and I also had to wait for it to start boiling good, but it did probably take at least a good hour or so more. And then as you see here, I took my hot glue gun and I did put a dab of glue in the bottom. And once the wax was melted, I went ahead and I pulled the wick out and glued it to the bottom of uh, these uh, pumpkins. I am showing here where this is the part where you can go ahead and trim part of the wick off. So I did go ahead and do that. Here is the part where originally you may have seen the four. I did take two out and I uh, left two in there. So I went ahead and I did uh, two by themselves and then later I came back in and did the other two. So here I am about to pour it down into the uh, pumpkins and then that way I can go ahead and harden so I'm doing that right here. Again, I'm sorry about the footage. Might be a little bit odd. <laughs> like I said, I was having to hold the camera in my left hand and pour it with my right hand. So it was a little challenging. And then here I am grabbing the second one. I needed to fill a little bit more because I did not have quite enough in uh, the, the second one there. All right, so I'm going to repeat the process now with these other two as well. And uh, I won't go through the whole entire footage here, but as you see in the back there, I did take two craft sticks and I went ahead and I uh, just placed them on each side of the wick to secure the uh, wick so that uh, it would stay upright pretty good. This is the part of the video that I was mentioning about that at the very end there, um, I was going to get ready to 
uh, put the, the wax uh, in there and uh, it spilled all over the place and made a big mess. And so I had to clean all that up. y'all so i hope that you enjoyed that video and that uh, it will give you some sort of inspiration uh besides just the pumpkins now i happen to find these uh at dollar tree and i could only find five i found five total um another one is over here in my kitchen on my shelf over here so i just left it plain and empty but i did go ahead and uh I uh, make candles with these, and these would be great gifts to give uh, to someone. Um, that's what I had planned on doing, but um, I've also seen where these can be done with like a mug, and you can uh, do the same same thing, you know, and give somebody a, a, a candle in a mug. So uh, I thought that that was a cute little idea as well, but when I saw these jars at Dollar Tree, uh, there was only one store that I could find these at, and I scooped them all up, all the ones that they had. So, uh, I love the way that this turned out. It was quite challenging along the way, and I had an accident at the very end. Um, I'm not sure if uh, that was uh, part of the footage or not. Uh, I, when I went back and looked, it uh, you couldn't really tell too much. Uh, from the footage, but yes, I did have a little accident. I had to pick up a lot of wax, so it was a mess. But other than that, uh, it was a uh, different project to uh, to do, So, and I had fun with it. But uh, like I said, I hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, as well as uh, if you're visiting for the first time, um, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button. And also, uh, if you want to be notified, hit that little bell as well. And so that way it will let you know when I have a new upload. And uh, as always, y'all, thanks for watching. Bye.